Okay, um, degrees, minutes, seconds on the calculator. First thing to notice, I'm in radian mode. Um, in radian mode, I'm going to do 36, and then if I go down here to the question mark key, I get a little degree symbol. If I press enter now, it'll convert that to radians um, by default, uh, which is nice. Um, next thing, uh, if I enter it in decimal degrees, just got to put a degree sign here, and then I am going to turn that into degrees, minutes, seconds. So I'm going to press catalog, and then I'm going to press uh, 2 to get over to this tab, and go to angle, and then scroll down to convert to DMS. So I'm going to convert to degrees, minutes, seconds. Press that, and it does it for you. Um, so it takes an argument that is an angle. Remember, you got to if you're not in degree mode, you have to put in the degree sign and it converts it for you. Um, this is a really interesting conversion because it says uh, 60 minutes, uh, seconds rather. Um, that's obviously rounded. Let's see if it'll show. Yep, wow. Good example. Um, another thing that you might want to do is you can actually um, do subtraction and things like that from the uh, degrees, minutes, seconds template. So if I want to enter something in degrees, minutes, seconds, you can see on uh, row two, column two, there's a template that looks like degrees, minutes, seconds. So if I do uh, 28, uh, let's 36, and then 15, and rather 15 and 14, um, it's going to give me the answer in radians because I'm in radian mode. If I take that and I multiply it by 180 over pi, um, and I want a decimal. So it goes back to um, the previously entered thing. So you can see up here, um, which is what I was expecting. Um, this is useful. So I'm in radian mode. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to solve one of those um, S equals R theta type problems. So the angles are given in degrees, minutes, seconds. So let's see. I need the template. So one of them is 45 degrees, 23 minutes. 14 seconds, and then I need to, I'm finding the difference between two latitudes here, so I'll enter the second one, 11, 12, and 52. When I press enter, it's going to turn this into radians, so that's, essentially, that's theta that I would need. Um, and then it's S equals R theta, so I'm going to multiply that answer by 6378.1 um, to get 3804.07. Um, this is actually the question from page 8 of notes 1. Um, how far apart are the cities along the um, circumference of the Earth? But anyway, that's how you use degrees, minutes, seconds on the calculator, um, and I hope that is helpful.